If you get pain in your mid-back or your lower mid-back, here's how to get some quick relief and how to stop it coming back. The vast majority of mid-back pain is caused from slouching, especially when we're sitting. So our main aim is to stretch the back the other way. But I find that a rotation stretch first helps to open and loosen the spinal joints and the rib joints, so let's start there. On a floor or bed, with your legs in this 90-90 position, place your hands so that they're parallel with your front thigh. Then, with straight arms, breathe out and rotate a bit further around until you feel a nice stretch in your lower mid-back. Hold this position for a few seconds and then repeat anywhere between three and five times on each side daily. But just start gently on the first day. Now you're ready to straighten up any mid-back joints that are stuck in a flexed position. So on your knees, put both hands right out in front of you and then with straight arms, lower your chest until your torso, head and arms are in a straight line. Breathe right out as you go down. Your thighs should end up vertical and you should feel it stretching in your lower mid-back. Hold that position for about five seconds and repeat five to 10 times. If your shoulders feel sore, put your hands wider apart. If your knees hurt or you need an exercise that's a bit more socially acceptable for work, you can do this up against a wall with your knees bent. Exercise three is a unique yoga variation. Lying face down, lift onto your elbows to enter a mini cobra position, but then mobilize the middle back while it's in this extended position by doing this. Bend one leg, allow it to drop inwards over the other leg, and then repeat on the other leg, alternating sides gently for a minute. Don't do this if it feels sore in your lower back though. And don't lift up too high, being slightly lower mobilizes the mid-back more. If you get really tight muscles in the area, these exercises can help to address the cause, which is usually restricted spinal and rib joints. But often the muscles need a bit of help too. Rolling a tennis ball along the band of muscles on either side of your spine against a wall for a couple of minutes can provide immediate muscle relief. Just round out your back, Bend your knees to roll the ball up and down the muscles. I'll leave a link in the description box below to a video that shows more details on how to do that. And sometimes the mid-back muscles just need some exercise to get some blood flow through them. Toxins like lactic acid can build up in muscles that are static and not moved enough. So some bird dog exercises are your best bet for that. I'll leave a link for details on that exercise too. Now if your spine feels really stiff and you think you need something a bit stronger to mobilize it, exercises that stretch the spine over a rolled up towel can help enormously. With legs bent, you lie over a rolled up towel and raise and lower your arms to mobilize tight spinal joints. I'll pop a link in the description box below for that exercise too. In most cases, a slumped slouch seating position is the cause of mid-back tightness and stiffness. So always try to sit right back in any chair that you're sitting in to try to keep the spine straight. And try to avoid sitting in bed. Now if you do those exercises that I showed you regularly as prevention, you can help to keep that area of your spine free to help stop it coming back. Anyway, there you go. I hope you liked the video. If you did, please consider liking and subscribing because it always really helps. And let me know how you go in the comment section below. Okay, cheers.